They do covert ops. Maybe they have a similar division. Aren't you guys already investigating Tunney? I saw you bring him into the conference room yesterday. You know Tunney? No, his picture was in a file that I glanced at. But he and his spec war unit are under investigation for the murder of a local tribal leader killed in Afghanistan. Tunney denied he was ever in the area where it occurred. Arrested twice. Salt Lake and New York City. Breaking and entering on both. Acquitted on both. Right. Lack of evidence. Couldn't find the goods. Not the case this time. You're a long way from your condo in South Florida, Gregoric. I like the sunshine. <laughs> Who wouldn't after a few months in a sewer? Looks like Portland's not your lucky town. Two murder charges we're gonna nail on you. And once we start looking into robberies in other cities, we think we're gonna find some more dead bodies. <laughs> Go home, have a drink, or whatever it is that you two do. You're wasting my time. Hola, hola, big man. Uh, me llamo David. Oh. He's got a gun. Oh, God. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey. Oh, God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Pablo Chacon. I'm here to pick up for Pablo Chacon. You want a white gringo with the haircut of a donkey? Uh, yeah, see. Si. Who are they? Um, that's, uh, uh my, uh, my family. You know, uh, me familia. You know, helping me out here with the, uh, the deal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Too familiar. <laughs> yeah, I know, I can't believe it either, yeah. Too <laughs> familiar! <laughs> Go! Hey, what's your name? Get off. Not you, the, the dog. You want me to? Nah, I, I kind of like him. When I was a kid, we had a dog about this size. Named him Biscuit. Coyotes ate it. You don't like him very much, do you? How can you tell? Well, you haven't named him for one. We, we got it as sort of training wheels for having a kid. It's a dog. It's not your kid. Something you just brought home last week. When you have a kid, that'll be yours. Trust me. I'm here for the mask. Shocker. You better pray you're not an Elvis. Wait, wait, wait. You're, uh, you're the Indian. Do I look like I'm from India? I meant, uh, Native American. Do I look like I work at 7-Eleven? But unfortunately for you, it is a tomahawk. And this Indian... Help! ...is gonna scalp you. I've never been good with hypotheticals, like on math tests. If two trains are headed towards each other at different speeds, I'll ask when will they hit, right? But I say, if you know they're gonna hit eventually, and there's no way to stop them? It doesn't matter when. I mean, who cares? The important thing is to get the people off the train, you know? Yeah, this is not an aptitude test. I mean, your company's track record speaks for itself, Mike. I'm sorry. I've just never been much of a test taker. That's why I went into business for myself. Yeah. What time did you pick up Raphael last night? Last night, huh? I didn't see Raphael last night. Okay, so why would Raphael's mother make up that story, Gino? I put those into the devil's candy, man. Fucking heroin. Shit. She was probably high. Cheap white man, just like the old days. Let's 
está aburrido. Esas cosas una vez. Este chico se metió un clavo su tico. Después de que cara, que se daba como un... ¡Cazú! <risa> <risa>